me and my little boy were just going along, looking to find some bait. Found a good spot to set the net, and all we had to do was wait. Well, all of a sudden, this guy comes out, shouting and waving his hands. He said, hey, you're on private property, and you got to get off of my sand. Mr. Mean High Water, you want us to be gone. Mr. Mean High Water, it ain't your sand we're on. You might think that you own it all, cause you got so much dough. Mr. Mean High Water, there's a lot that you don't know. The rules around here are pretty clear when it comes to who owns the shore. The water side of the mean high tide is everyone's rich or poor. Now you might think the wall you see is yours, but here's a big news flash. You might try, but you couldn't buy it if you used up all your cash. Mr. Mean High Water, sorry to spoil your view. Mr. Mean High Water, there's nothing you can do. We can sit and swim and fish and look out on the water. And if you don't know the rules by now, well maybe then you want to. Go ahead. around here are pretty weary of people with lots of money. We think that they own the land and the sky, but we don't think that's funny. Now I'm just a local son of the beach, and all I can say is that, that we each have the right to a light on that sandy shore, and here's just one thing more. Mr. Mean High Water, hope you learn this lesson well. Mr. Mean High Water, Wish I'd go in a helicopter, fly you from the city to the beach in just about an hour. But the sea that you see, it seems to me, ain't yours or mine, but ours. Mr. Mean High Water, we won't go away. Mr. Mean High Water, no matter what you say. Mr. Mean High Water, we'll sit on the beach and play. Mr. Mean High Water Can't wait till Labor Day Thank you. True story. Absolutely true.